No, I want to congratulate you on the opening of uh, the store. Thank you. It's funny, I've been traveling and I've been to like three different continents in the last, uh, I don't know, like two or three months. And like, all I see is Beast by Dre on ears, on planes, in Vietnam, in Jamaica, in London, you know? It's crazy. It's really, we hit a lick, man. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shocked myself, man, as, how, as to how well they're doing. Yeah. And we're going to keep new and exciting product coming, okay. man, you know? so. Okay. We're trying to eventually be second to Apple, you okay, know, and okay. I, I don't think that's a bad position. <laughs> We're really trying to take over everything with a speaker. Wow. You know what I'm saying? And also microphones. We're going to get involved okay. in that also. Wow. What's different about like your approach to the sound and the head headphones? Then? Well, I think what makes me a little bit different in that area is the fact that I started out as an engineer. Mm. You know, I started out on the mixing board first mm -hmm. when I was, you know, 15, 16 years old. Okay. I had a, the opportunity to go in this guy's garage that I knew they had a mixing board set up. So I learned that technique okay. first before I touched the drum machine, before I was even interested in producing. Okay. So I spent a lot of time on a mixing board okay. first, which I think gave me a little bit of an edge over the other producers that are out there. How long have you guys been in the process of like developing? Well, as of August, mm. the headphones have been out for three years okay. and um, two years before that. So this is just, it's just five years and okay. we've been able to accomplish some phenomenal things in just okay. a short period of time. So um, yeah, it's a really fun thing. It's a new outlet for me to get creative. Okay. Yeah, my idea has always been to protect my brand and make sure that everything that I do is quality and it was just hands down the best of its kind, whatever that may be, okay. you know what I'm saying? So, you know, that's been my thing from the top. Just okay. make sure that everything that I do is the shit. That's okay. it, you and know? It, and it has been. <laughs> How do you feel about the music? Like, what, what do you, I, I looked on your site earlier and I saw someone named Slim. Slim the Mobster. Slim, yeah. Yeah, like, these, are, you, these are the next two artists I'm working on, Slim the Mobster and Kendrick Lamar. Okay. I think that's what I'm gonna just um, wrap it up for a minute because I've been working on music for 27 years now. And the okay. longest I've ever been out of the studio in 27 years has been two weeks. Really? So yeah, I feel like I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. I'm never gonna stop music. It's like air to me. So I'm gonna take a little bit of a break, enjoy some time with the family, and Beautiful. it's like until I get that itch to get back in. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> there you have it. Thank you very much. Thank Dr. you, man. Dre. All right. Cool. Love. All right. Peace.